Hey guys, Nate here. Today's data science interview question comes from Facebook. It's called Search Rankings. The title of the question is called Search Ranking and it's from Facebook. The question reads, you're given a table that represents search results from searches on Facebook. The query column is the search term and the position column represents the position the result came in. Write a query to calculate the percentage of search results that were in the top three position. So what I want to do first is check out the table to see the underlying data to see what we have to work with. So what I'm going to do first is preview the search results table here. So it looks like what we have here is the query column, which is the search term, the result ID, and then the position in which the result came in, and then the notes, which I'm guessing is the post. All right, so what I want to do is work with this position column and classify rows where we're in the top three positions. So now let's write out our approach and discuss assumptions. So what I want to do first is use this position column and classify all rows where we're in the top three. So in order to do that, I'll write a SQL query and I'll use it as a subquery and then left join that back into the original table. So that's important because I want to preserve all of the rows in the original table so that we can calculate a percentage. So that's why I'm going to be using a left join. So what I'm going to write here in the approach is to write a subquery to flag posts in top three position, left join subquery with original table, and so when I left join the subquery to the original table, what I'll have in, in terms of the data in the table will look like this. So what I have here is the result ID, the position, and this is actually going to be coming from the original table. And then the top three is just my subquery where I'm classifying and identifying the posts that are in the top three. So I can basically have two scenarios. So in this scenario here, we have a post in position seven. And so when we left join the subquery that identifies the top three, we're actually just gonna get a null. And so in this scenario here, we have a post in the top three and our subquery also identifies it and flags it as a top three post. So we have values here instead of a null. So once I join those two tables together, I'll have enough information to calculate a percentage. So what I'll do is I'll count the top three posts and then divided by all of the posts that I see. So I can just say result ID here. And what I wanna do after that is convert that into a decimal, right? Because we basically have a account, which is an integer divided by another count, which is also an integer. So an integer divided by an integer is an integer. So we need to convert that to a decimal or a float data type. And then from that, we have a decimal and we can multiply that by 100 to get a percentage. So that's the approach and those are all the assumptions. So what I'll do next is start coding. So I'm gonna create the subquery first. I'll have a select result ID with the position from the table. And what I wanna do next is just output posts where the position is in the top three. So in the where clause, I'll have position is less than or equal to three. And that'll be my subquery. So next what I wanna do is take this subquery and left join it into the original table here. So that's gonna look like this. So my left join is complete, and just to test this entire query, I'll run it, and it looks like I have the two scenarios that I was talking about where I have the position here, and then the classification of whether or not this post is in the top three. So I have these null values here, and then when I get to a post that's in the top three, I actually have values from the subquery. 
So what we want to do now is count up all of these values and then divide it by all of the rows in the table. So that's going to look like this. So if I run this query, I have 41.67. And if I check the solution, I have it correct. And so this is one approach to calculate the percentage of search results that were in the top three. There are multiple other ways to solve this problem that will get you to the exact same solution. So if you think of any other approaches, please leave a comment.